So this question says the sales manager of a company awarded a total of $3,000 in bonuses to the most productive salespeople. So this is a translate word problem question. I'm going to take that information from the first sentence. I'm just going to write it down. So $3,000, just my arrow here saying that those $3,000 went to bonuses. The next sentence, the bonuses were awarded in amounts of $250 or $750. So then here are the two amount options, 250. You can be in that category or you can be in the $750 category. If at least one $250 bonus and at least one $750 bonus were awarded, I'm gonna just put some marks here. So let's say I have one of those and one of those. What is one possible number of $250 bonuses awarded? Well, one possible, what is one possible number? That means there are many correct answers, right? So that's code for, if it's asking you for only one possible number, that means there are more than just the one that you choose. So if I have one person getting 250 and one person getting 750, I'd have a total of $1,000. This is how I'm choosing to solve this question. I know that I want to get up to $3,000. So I've only given away 1000 at this point. So I have 2000 left to give out. The question does not tell me how many people are awarded the bonuses. So how do I get to this 2000 Well, I'm going to just say, you know, which one of these check sizes goes into 2000 evenly. 750 does not go into 2000 evenly. But 250 does go into 2,000 evenly. And in fact, it goes in eight times, right? 250 times eight is 2,000. So I know when I add these together that if I gave out nine $250 checks or bonuses and one $750 bonus, I will have given out, if I'm the sales manager, I will have given out 3,000 total dollars which means I've accomplished exactly what the question asked me to find. So nine is a good answer. I recognize that there are more than just nine, right? Nine is not the only good answer. In fact, I'll show you one other answer here. So let's say instead, let's say instead, let's go back to 250 and 750. Let's say I wanted to give out three of these. So if I gave out three $750 bonuses, that's a total of $2,250, meaning I have $750 remaining in order to have given out a total of $3,000. So then how do I make up that remaining $750? Well, I could have three $250 checks, right? Because that's how I get my $750 that is remaining outside of what I already gave from the three $750 checks. So another good answer here would be that there are three, right? Three of these $250 bonuses. So three works, nine works. There are other numbers that work as well. Um, you don't care about finding all of them. You just care about finding one possible.